Welcome back. Today, a new groundbreaking study on the use of psychedelics to treat addiction. Doctors at NYU report significant improvements in patients who use the active ingredient in so-called magic mushrooms, along with psychotherapy to reduce alcohol abuse. NBC News medical fellow Dr. Akshay Sayal joins us now with more on this. So, doctor, this was the largest clinical st study of its kind, the clinical trial. Walk us through what happened here. So, Stephen, really what they found was that, yes, this was the largest clinical trial looking at how psilocybin, which is found in magic mushrooms, can help uh, cure alcohol or treat alcohol addiction. I mean, so what they found off the top was that, you know, those who took the psilocybin saw an 80 percent reduction in the amount of heavy drinking days they had. And, and here's the really cool part. Half of the people in the psilocybin group actually stayed sober for about eight months after their first dose. Wow. And how exactly does psilocybin? What is the drug again? Psilocybin. Psilocybin. I'll work on that. How exactly does it work? So, so the, best, the best idea, our best guess right now, is that it makes the brain more malleable to change. Hmm. And so, you know, th there's two components here. There's a psilocybin and there's a therapy. You really need both. Because just because you're more open to change doesn't mean you're going to change for the better. So you really need that therapy to help guide you and help change you and, and, and work on your alcohol addiction. And I understand you spoke to a patient who was part of this study. What did he have to say? Yeah, so the patient's name was John. And, you know, like a lot of people with alcohol use disorder, he'd been drinking for a long time. And so he enrolled in this trial looking because nothing else had really worked. Um, and so basically what, what, he, what happened with him was he, he took a few doses. He had the hallucinogenic effects. Um, and, uh, you know, it, it cured him of, of his alcohol. He said when he, sees, when he sees alcohol now, he no longer has a desire to drink. Here's what he had to say. This worked almost like an antibiotic for me, where I was sick with a disease or a disorder. I went into this clinical trial, and this surpassed that. This took away, this eliminated all my cravings to the point where it cured my alcoholism. Wow. So, Dr. Sayal, what are the next step here, and when could this be available to more people? So, it's, it's going to be a little while. So, in order for this to be more available, we have to have larger studies. So, this study was about 100 people, and we need those larger studies to make sure that we can replicate this. Does it actually work when you expand it to more people? So, NYU is actually starting a bigger study, and they hope to have data within about three years' time. Fascinating. Definitely expect to hear more on that one, something I did not see coming. Yeah. Dr. Sayal, thanks so much. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.